As the world's most valuable solar technology company, Longji is changing the industry with product innovation and will change the global energy structure with technical innovation. From photovoltaic materials to modules to solar PV systems, Longji provides a full range of services for photovoltaic power generation. We've always put our faith in monocrystalline technology and our mission to improve productivity and standard of living offers sustainable clean energy to society. This video offers a brief introduction to solar module structure and guide as to how to properly manage them after you receive your solar modules. This is a photovoltaic module of Longji. Its structure includes aluminum alloy frame, anti-reflection coated glass, encapsulant material, high efficiency solar cell, encapsulant material, backside, electrical performance parameter nameplate, module label, junction box, cables and connectors, back sheet. If it's double glass module, the back sheet is replaced by glass. On the frame of the module, there are mounting holes, grounding hole, and drain hole. Be sure to understand the module structure before installation so as to install them correctly. Please unload the goods on firm and flat ground. Upon arrival of the modules, please check whether the packaging box is in good condition and check that the module model and quantity information on packing list outside the box are consistent with the delivery order. If there is something wrong with the packaging box or module model number, please contact Longji customer service immediately. Modules can be unloaded by forklift or crane. When using a forklift to unload the modules, the lifting capacity of the forklift should be more than 2.5 tons. The fork prong should go into pallet at least three quarters of the pallet depth during unloading and the forklift should have buffer protection materials. Unload the modules slowly and gently. When crane is used to unload the modules, please use specialized tooling to prevent the sling from squeezing the pallet and damaging the modules. Please adjust the position of the sling. Keep the module steady. Each hoisting shall not be more than two boxes. When placing the modules, do not lower the packing box too quickly. Please align the upper and lower boxes perfectly and do not stack more than two boxes. For the modules in storage, please keep the wrapping film and packing carton in good condition. For the modules stored outside, in case of rainy weather, be sure to cover them with rain cloth in time. Please use appropriate means of transport to transfer the modules. After the modules arrive at the construction site, please verify whether the model, power bin, current class, quantity, and other information in the shipping mark are correct, and ensure that the modules of the same current class are stacked together. Please make sure that the packaging box is in good condition before unpacking it. It is recommended to use art knife to remove the packing strap and wrapping film. Careful handling is required during unloading to avoid scratching the modules in the box. After opening the lid of the box, please carefully check the number of the modules in the box and the barcode information on the frame to verify whether they are consistent with the information on the shipping mark. Before removing the inner packing strap, please take precautions to prevent the toppling of the whole box of modules. There should be two persons grasping the shorter edges of the module at the same time to take the module out and then place it gently on the pallet. Do not take out the module by one person. To prevent the module from being damaged or cracked due to slipping, please note that the glass side of the first module should face up. The glass side of other modules should face down. The upper and lower module should be aligned. The glass side of the top module should face up. The number of stacked modules per pallet should not exceed the number of modules per box. Do not stamp or knock on any part of the module. Do not stand or put heavy objects on the module so as not to cause micro cracks in the module. 
Do not touch the junction box of the module and the metal connecting the cable so as to prevent electric shock. Carefully check the module before installation to see if there is glass burst, cell fragment, back sheet scratch, aluminum frame deformation, junction box falling off or lid missing, nameplate falling off or missing, broken cable or plug, and other anomalies. If any such situation is found, please record it by taking pictures and file it, and contact Long G Customer Service in time. There are two conventional installation methods for Long G modules, using bolts and using clamps. Let's first take a look at the clamp installation method. First, place the outer module. Adjust the positions of the module and the clamp according to the design requirements. Put washer on the bolt. Pass through the clamp and the supporting system, and then put on washer, spring washer, and nut. Fasten the bolt. The torque should be 14 to 20 nanometers after fastening the clamps on the first module. Place the second module. After adjusting the installation location of the second module, then place the clamps between two modules. Fastening the clamps on the right edge of the first module and the left edge of the second module at the same time. The bolt installation method is relatively simple. The installation procedure is the same as the clamp installation, except it does not use clamps, but use the mounting holes on frame of the module, and fastens the module to the supporting system with bolts. During installation, please do not knock, sit, lie, tread, kneel, or climb on the module. Otherwise, microcracks of cell will happen in the module, and microcracks will affect the power generation performance of the module. When conducting electrical connection of the module, please use diagonal pliers to cut the cable tie. When cutting the tie, avoid scratching the cable and back sheet. According to electrical design requirements, connect the connectors between modules in turn. When you hear a click sound, it indicates that the connection is successful. Otherwise, during the operation of the module, there could lead to electric arc due to poor connection and can burn the connector. Before commissioning, check the electrical connection of modules and strings, making sure all connection polarity is correct and the open circuit voltage meets the requirements of the acceptance criteria. To reduce the risk of lightning and for electrical safety, the module frame must be reliably grounded. 12 AWG copper wire can be used for grounding between modules. Connect the adjacent grounding holes on the module frames using the copper wire to complete safety grounding between modules. The unused mounting holes on the frame can also be used for grounding. Modules must be inspected and maintained regularly. This is the user's unavoidable responsibility and when damage or other significant abnormalities is found on a module, please inform Long G customer service in time. Accumulated dust and dirt can reduce the energy yield of the module or even cause hot spots. Therefore, the glass surface of the module should be cleaned regularly. Do not clean the broken module and the module with damaged cable so as to avoid electric shock. Please arrange the cleaning schedule of the modules reasonably. It's better to clean in the morning or evening on cloudy or rainy days when the irradiation is low. You can use sponge, non-woven fabric or other soft materials and rubber glass wipe as cleaning tools. Do not use blade, steel wire ball or other hard materials to clean the modules. You can use glass cleaning agents on the market or alcohol solution. Do not use grinding powder, polishing agent, acid solution, alkali solution, gasoline or steam to help with cleaning. The water pressure flushing the module should not exceed 690 kilopascals. The temperature difference between the water and the module must be between minus 5 degrees Celsius and 10 degrees Celsius and the pH value should be between 6 and 8. During cleaning, do not stand or walk on the module.
adhering to a reliable, value-added, and pleasant corporate culture, Longji continues to provide quality energy and services to society, relying on the advantages of large-scale production, whole industry chain, innovation, brand and advantage accumulated over the years. Longji is committed to become the world's most valuable solar technology company, promoting PV plus storage across globe, enabling more people to benefit from green energy and accelerating the change toward green and low-carbon energy.